George Hansen, the Pope of Pugilism. I'm here today with the man that met the legend himself, the Candyman, boxing trainer, whose fighter, Benny the Jewish Bulldog Sinekin, will be making his professional debut August 11th, 2300 Arena, Hard Hitting Promotions. Benny couldn't be here today, but I'd be remiss if I didn't say, give a shout out to Benny's mom, Chanel Sinekin, and Benny's family back in the islands, in St. Vincent and the Grenadines. They all cheer for Benny. Benny has a large family. Well, let's talk about Benny, Candyman. What do you want to know? He made his professional debut, long awaited. Mm -hmm. It was postponed. He was pulled at Fort uh, July the 21st, okay. if I can recall. So now he fights um, next Saturday, August 11th, at the arena. 2300 Arena. The 2300 Arena. Hard hitting promotion, Manny Rivera and the crew. Okay, I see you got the Bulldog yeah. here, man. Is that, let's, ben, oh, Benny the Bulldog Syndicate. Let's see the back here. Oh, he's, a, he's a postman. He's a postman. Let's see yeah, the back. Work for the post office. The Bulldog always deliver. Okay, he works for the U.S. Postal Service. Um, so, um, the Bulldog, man, talk to me about his focus. I, he's been running the drive. He's been training hard. If, if, if people have been um, watching me, you and I interviews, like the last couple of interviews, I always talk about Benny, how determined he is, right. how dedicated he is, how disciplined he is, and it hasn't changed. Right. Now, you know, his debut, he's, he's been running the, the whole drive. He never he never jogged the drive before. Right. And he done did it twice already. And we're going to finish up one more, like maybe one more time this week. That means he done did the drive three times in less than two weeks. And he's never ran uh, nine miles ever in his life. Right. So I'm like, and still works a full-time job. Mm -hmm. Right. Benny, <laughs> Benny works full-time. <laughs> At, for the U.S. Postal Services? Yes. He yes. delivers mail? Yes. So thus we have the Bulldog always deliver. Why wouldn't he? Okay. So, <laughs> Why wouldn't he? <laughs> you know, and it's going to deliver August the 11th. Too. August the 11th. Hard I pity promotion. the fool to call Mr. T. I pity the fool I who steps in that ring with Benny, Benjamin Sinekin, man. And August 11th, man, um, people have to know that Benny came all the way down from super heavyweight light heavyweight. 288 pounds. Now he's now he's 175 pounds. 171. I, I, didn't to, I, didn't to, I didn't want to put that out there, Chick. He weighed 171 the other day okay. as he finished uh, jogging the drive. But we're trying to keep around 75, mm -hmm. you know, for his pro debut as, as, as a light heavyweight. But um, I mean, we're excited. I'm excited. And uh, oh, just to, just to let you know, too, this is my pro debut as well. Oh, as a trainer. As a trainer. Okay, there you have so it. So now I'm on the opposite side of the ring. Okay, you're so a trainer, first fighter that will be making their professional debut. Yeah, yes. So you're a professional trainer. Yes. Yeah, so I'm excited about about about, about me uh, that that night, mm -hmm. that night as well. What's the prediction, man? I'm going for the night. I'm going for the night. I have to. You have to. I have to. Mm -hmm. Okay. Even training is hard. Why, why play around four rounds? Mm -hmm. Knock the man out. Knock the man out. Do what you was trained to do. Do what you were trained to do. Okay, I mean, <laughs> Benny, man, uh, I've, I've seen him, I've looked at him, the way he's been able to move, the way he's been able to cut weight, and a lot of people who lose that type of weight, they're not solid, but you look at Benny, he's chiseled. Me personally, I thought that Benny's only 20 years old. Right. I thought it was a lot of baby fat. Okay. And he was being lazy mm -hmm. when he was an amateur. Mm -hmm. So once he, he, he graduated high school and he decided after he lost the Pennsylvania Golden Gloves this year, mm -hmm. Tatif Alberto, Alberto right. a great fighter, Alberto, yeah. a great fighter. Right. He uh, won the national battle. Won, won the nat two, two time national winner. 2016. Two time national winner. Okay. Yeah. Big up Tatif as well. Um, Benny decided. He wanted to turn pro. Okay. So, prior to that, he just got super serious and dedicated. Uh, his dad also changed his diet. Right. Mm -hmm. Gave him a strict diet plan, mm -hmm. and he's still sticking to it to this day. Okay. And, you know, a lot of people, Benny has two flavors going. His dad, Lincoln Seneca, is Jewish from yes. South Philadelphia. Yes. His mom, Chanel, is from St. Vincent and Grenadine. So, Benny, like I call him, man, I call him 
Lenny Kravitz and boxing gloves. Wow. Did Talk you about that. Ball? Lenny you remind me of Lenny Kravitz. <laughs> it looks like Listen, Lenny Kravitz. It looks like Lenny Kravitz too. Oh, boxing yeah, gloves. Yeah, with boxing gloves. So he, get, he yeah. has those two flavors. Yeah, going. yeah. He's, uh, he's just a wonderful kid and he's going to um, have a wonderful pro debut and I'm excited for him and his family as well so he can um, start his career in boxing. Man. And you know, yeah. I, I heard from his pop that Benny's entrance music is going to be I'm Blessed by my Jamaican brother, Mr. Vegas. Right up your alley, chick. So, right up your alley, man. So, I've never said we ever jump up to Mr. Vegas next Saturday night. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be jumping up. So, he's coming out to I'm Blessed by yes, Mr. Yeah. Vegas. I heard the song. It's a beautiful song. It's a nice song. And um, he is blessed. And I he's hope blessed. Mr. Vegas is watching this. So, if you're ever in Philadelphia, Mr. Vegas, you need to walk Benny the Jewish Bulldog in the canal for his next fight. That'll be, that'll be, that'll be wonderful. That'll be a dream come true. Anything else you want to tell the fans about 11th Man and your fighter since you're making your debut as a professional trainer? Benny's making his debut as a professional fighter. And, and I'm, it's, it's a beautiful card. You have Jeremy King Quavis mm -hmm. on there. You have Derek, Derek Webster. Webster. Eric Hunter. Eric Hunter, the outlaw. Brandon Pizarro. Brandon Pizarro. Oh, these are all guys that I love and I watched over the years. Oh, uh, 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 Sam Teeth. Oh, Sam oh, T. Sam T. Sam, oh, Sam, Sam T. Sam T. Yeah. Sam, Sam, yep. Sam, your T. Yeah. Oh, man. You talk lights out August 11th, man. Philadelphia. Uh, uh, um, Hard-hitting. Hard-hitting promotion. The 2300 Arena. We're coming your way. Well, fight fans, here you have it. From my son, Williams, a.k.a. The Candy Man. This fighter, Benny, the Jewish Bulldog, Sinekin, will be making his debut. And The Candy Man is making his debut as a professional trainer. Just want to give a shout out to all our fans in St. Vincent and the Grenadines. Everybody who's related to Benny's mom, Chanel Sinekin. Thanks for watching. Continue to watch Boxing 396. Come on out to 2300 Arena next Saturday, August 11th. Part of the promotions. Take care and have a great day. Thank you, Candy Man. Here comes the hot stepper. I'm the lyrical gangster. Big up the crew in the area. Still have you like that. No, no, we don't die. Yes, we multiply. Anyone press will hear the ballet sing. I said, you know, Rico, I know what both them know. Touch them up and go. Oh, cha-cha-ching-ching. Ching. Here come the hot